this week we are taking a look at some local authors with new books that you can find right now on store shelves or online. I recently spoke with Wendy Acefo from Bravo's Real Housewives of Potomac, and she has a new memoir out about being a first-generation Nigerian-American called Tears of My Mother. Most people know Wendy Osefo from Bravo's hit show, Real Housewives of Potomac. But you may not know she's added author to her long list of accomplishments. She just released her first book, Tears of My Mother, The Legacy of My Nigerian Upbringing, a story of growing up as a child of immigrants in the middle of two different cultures. As I started to analyze that, I was like, wait, I can't talk about being a first-gen immigrant if I don't talk about the person who raised me. So then I do a deep dive into how was I raised? What does it mean to be the child of an immigrant? What does it mean to now raise my own children in a world that is different from the one in which I was raised in? Not only is Wendy raising three kids with her husband in suburban Maryland, but she's also a college professor, political commentator, and business owner. She says this book takes a deep dive into how she tries to find balance in it all. I think on this season of Real Housewives of Potomac, you guys actually see that. You guys see me face a lot of health challenges because I'm giving so much to others and not taking any time to myself. And I think that that story is something that all women go through. Wendy tells me this book reveals a side of her viewers don't see on TV as she struggles to create her own identity while managing her mother's expectations. Quite frankly, you don't know who you are until you really examine what you have come from. And this book does that. It takes you on a journey of exploration, on a journey of examination. And then at the very end, you have a level of contentment to say, yes, this may be who I am. But quite frankly, I'm OK with that. No, Wendy told me she really has a desire as a mother uh, to allow her three children to follow their own paths. By the way, Bravo is owned by our parent company, NBC Universal. But